I wake up to find Ma leaving a cup of hot tea by my bedside. My fingers, all five in drowsy glory, recoil, curling up, shunning the sudden heat. The heat hidden in the calm of the cup. Leaving behind the geography of its prints, like the morning's first light on upturned shoe soles, left behind by a receding flood. There is no school bus waiting for me today. My fingers calm down, uncoil. It is said a good cup of tea can stop time for a while. Ma knows how to stop time every Sunday morning. The boughs outside my window throw long shadows of black nerves on my bed. As I wake up and clumsily smudge the spectacle lenses with a dozen more fingerprints, a habit that has stayed, blurring reality for a while since childhood every single morning. It is 8 a.m. I wrap my hands around a hot cup of tea. My fingers twitch, hesitate, recoil. It has learned skepticism over the years. The tea too, less naive than before, cools down faster, impatient to move on. But my fingerprints are still hidden on the metal of the cup, creating rivers and plateaus, the same landscape, the same crests, the same turns, the same smells. Only this time, Sundays pass by in a jiffy.